My favorite look from season 10 was the one I was shaded on. America the card dress. Hello. I should have won. <laughs> Gag. My favorite runway for season seven was the evening gown. The one I went home on because that was a sketch that I found and my good friend Adam McGee, Chad Michael's boyfriend, he had brought that to life for me. And I could not wait to wear that dress. <laughs> so that was the best for me. That was my favorite. Oh, my favorite runway. You know what, I'm gonna choose my most embarrassing one. It was, I'm gonna choose the glitter runway. <laughs> because bitch, I don't know, that day I was feeling some kind of fantasy. I'm gonna give them funny positivity, um, you know, to quote, to quote Eureka. And I was feeling my oats, bitch. I saw that tape and I was like, this is penny dreadful, girl. But you know what, for me, it was a moment that I lived and I'm still proud of it. I still think it was at least decent. I should've won still, I think. My favorite runway was Probably the scarecrow, and not because I like won the challenge. It was like the first time I didn't have to tuck. <laughs> yeah, it was really comfortable on the runway. <laughs> well, there wasn't that many, but honestly, I would have to say I think it was our best drag look when it came down like this crazy cuckoo alien look. I had on like this neon and black like cat suit, and I was totally feeling it. And I definitely think by far that was my best look on the season. I think my favorite runway from season nine was definitely the Club Kid. I think it got to show a completely different side of who I am as an entertainer, and it was fun. It wasn't expected, and I got to, again, be a different character than, you know, a normal Trinity pageant queen. Hands down, my favorite runway probably should be the bridal runway because that's when I won a challenge, but personally, Girl, my favorite challenge was the Madonna one. The Madonna runway, the Night of a Thousand Madonnas, for sure, because I practically wasn't wearing anything. I was, I sprayed adhesive a bar here, a bar there, and then turn around and you could see my bare butt, which is not necessarily the biggest butt in the world. It's kind of just, you know, a flap of skin, a hole in the wall, you know? <laughs> But girl, I was bronze to the gods. And in that moment, I really transcended my confidence and my energy and kind of just wearing a lot of nothing. Oh, my most favorite runways ever were, oh, my pineapple. I love my pineapple. It's so much fun. Everyone keeps giving me pineapples that I meet. All my fans keep giving me pineapples. People will be like, here, I found this in the hardware store. It's a pineapple. Here, though, here, do you want some pineapple? Like, I made you some pineapple. Do you want some pineapples on your pizza? I'm like, hell no. But, you know, pineapples. This is the pineapple dress. My favorite runway? The blue gown was where I felt my most beautiful self. And it's iconic. That's kind of like my signature. Everyone knows that dress. And, um, so I can't ever wear it again, but. Uh, <laughs> I think my favorite runway from season nine was getting to do the Night of a Thousand Madonnas. Ever since I was a little girl, I've always been such a fan of Madonna. And, you know, luckily one of my best friends in Vegas is a, has been a Madonna impersonator since 1989. So it was like, whatever look I wanted, it could be done. It was just everything. I mean, Madonna's life, so. Hey, squirrel friend, when one video ends, just open up another one. It's called binge viewing. Go ahead. I support you.